I am Dr. Ola Kalawale, board certified family practice physician, as well as founder and CEO of MedMatch MD. MedMatch MD is a centralized one stop online platform where students can search and compare close to 40 offshore Caribbean medical schools and get to a decision on what school is right for them. Our mission at MedMatch MD is to give pre meds a second chance of fulfilling their dream. Our goal is to help pre-meds and non-traditional pre-med students who are frustrated and losing hope due to unsuccessful attempts of getting accepted to U.S. or Canadian medical schools and just want to be given a chance to fulfill their dream of becoming doctors. We believe everyone who aspires to become a doctor should fulfill it. That is why I created MedMatch MD. We recently launched MedMatch MD website as well as Spotlight, where we highlight amazing Caribbean medical schools, students, and alumni. There is an enormous amount of misinformation about Caribbean medical schools online, so our goal is to feature inspiring interviews of successful Caribbean medical school students and alumni, and inspire students to consider attending medical school in the Caribbean. What we aspire to accomplish is to create more awareness of our platform to prospective students, as well as partner with offshore Caribbean medical schools. According to the American Academy of Medical Colleges, in the 2019-2020 cycle, out of 53,000 plus students that applied to U.S. Uh, medical schools, only 41% of applicants were admitted. Not to even talk about Canada, where only 18% were accepted in the 2015 application cycle, according to a CBS article. Now, this leaves us close to 60% of U.S. and 80% of Canadian medical school applicants walking away from their dream of becoming doctors. Many of these students are not only qualified, but competitive. However, there's just not enough spots for all applicants. My personal story and journey inspired me to create MedMatchMD. See, 18 years ago, I was that pre-med student who became frustrated when I didn't get into a U.S. Um, medical school. However, I did not let that rejection stop me. Instead, it propelled me to finding out a valid and wonderful alternative of attending a Caribbean medical school. The rest, they say, is history. I graduated from medical school, got uh, into an amazing residency program in the United States, even had the wonderful opportunity of serving as chief resident, graduated, and have been in practice for close to 10 years as a board-certified family medicine physician. Over the years, I've had lots of pre-meds ask me about attending Caribbean Medical School, and I've been able to influence a number of students who are in different stages of their journey. A particular individual that I had the opportunity of impacting is my childhood friend, who always dreamed of becoming a physician. However, she had several setbacks along the way and chose a different career path. Years later, we reconnected, and I encouraged her to apply to school in the Caribbean she did, and she's now a practicing attending physician here in the United States. So it dawned on me that if I'm impacting lives on an individual basis, why not make this a platform where I can influence so many other lives and help others fulfill their dream of becoming MDs as well. This is what inspired me to create MedMatch MD. For any pre-med or non-traditional pre-med student watching this video, I encourage you to apply to as many U.S. or Canadian schools as possible. However, if you're not accepted, don't give up because you have options. The truth of the matter is less than 50% of those who apply to U.S. medical schools actually get accepted. In Canada, less than 20% of those who apply are accepted. So there is a significant number of students, regardless of how competitive their MCAT or GPA scores are, that won't get accepted into a U.S. or Canadian school. Unfortunately, like I mentioned earlier, there's just not enough seats for the number of applicants. That is why an offshore Caribbean medical school is a valid and proven option to allow you to still fulfill your dream of becoming a doctor. I chose this path many years ago because I simply did not want to spend any more time reapplying or trying options that wouldn't necessarily guarantee 
acceptance into a U.S. or Canadian medical school. Myself and so many other doctors have successfully graduated from Caribbean medical schools and are practicing in the United States and Canada. My goal is that you succeed regardless of the path you take. I encourage pre-meds and non-traditional pre-meds to visit medmatchmd.com or share the website with prospective students who would like more information about attending medical school in the Caribbean. Now, all Caribbean medical schools are not created equal, so I highly recommend that you do your due diligence and research in choosing the school that is right for you. And that is why I have carefully curated the most important information to guide you in making a decision. As a member of the MedMatch MD community, you can easily search and compare up to three schools side by side and decide on which school is right for you. You also get full access to close to 40 offshore Caribbean medical schools, as well as the location of the schools, MCAT requirements, accreditation, USMLE pass rates, scholarship information, financial aid information, and much more. Also on our website, you have access to our blog that provides tips on applying to Caribbean medical schools, as well as testimonials by successful alumni. If you have a project or personal interest, that you're passionate about, I recommend you definitely pursue it. There's never a better time than now. Get all the information you need as well as a coach to help you fine tune your idea and a mentor who has walked the same path. I'm honored to be a full-time practicing physician and an entrepreneur and you can do the same as well. For any aspiring physicians, uh, my advice to you is first of all ask yourself why. Why do you want to pursue medicine? Your answer has to be strong enough that no matter what, your, uh, what obstacle you encounter in your journey, you keep moving forward towards your goal. You're going to need to be focused, resilient, and determined. Last thing you want is uh, to deviate sorry, from your aspirations due to a temporary setback. Keep your eyes on the prize. The sky is the limit. You can become a physician you've always wanted to be. And for those interested in entrepreneurship as well as a career in medicine, it is not an easy path, however it's possible. Try not to engage in too many life goals at once. Focus on medicine first if this is your passion. Once you're a practicing physician, you can consider other aspirations. If you're interested in obtaining more information about MedMatchMD, sign up again at MedMatchMD.com to search, compare, and get to a decision an attending an offshore Caribbean medical school. Share the, uh, the website with uh, pre-med students, non-traditional pre-med students, or aspiring doctors, you know. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel at MedMatchMD. And you can follow me on Instagram at doc underscore Ola at MedMatchMD. I wish you the very best in your pursuit. Thanks. Have a great day. <music>